Dynamics GP provides the ability to require the approval of batches before posting. Setup for this feature is quick and easy. Passwords are required before posting, and unique passwords can be required by transaction type. Let's take a quick look at the setup and use of batch approvals. By default, the batch approval feature is not enabled. You can see in this batch entry screen that it is grayed out for each batch that we would attempt to mark as approved. The feature can be easily turned on in the posting setup window. And you can turn this feature on by series and specific posting window that you want to enable it for. For example, under purchasing, if we want to do it for payables transaction entry, we would simply enable it here. For our purposes, we'll do it under the general ledger general entry screen. We'll require batch approval and we'll provide a simple password. When we create a general ledger batch, we'll be able to mark it for approval. Let's go and create a simple journal entry, create a simple batch, approval, add that batch. You can now see it is enabled, the feature. We'll do a journal entry for accrued insurance. Select our liability insurance. Give it a dollar amount. Select our accrued expenses. And save entry. Go back to our batch see that it is unapproved at this point and with the one journal entry in if we attempt to post it we will get an error message that it needs to be approved before it can be posted. By marking it approved we're required to enter the password. The batch has now been approved it records who the user is and the approval date and is now ready for posting. With this short video, we have demonstrated the batch approval process in Dynamics GP and how setup is quick and easy and unique passwords can be set up by each type of posting batch in Dynamics GP. Please use the contact information on the screen to request more information on batch approvals or Dynamics GP or to set up a custom demonstration. Thank you.